think Porygon staying alive is very, very important. Nice. Okay, Spirit Tomb. That's what I wanted to see. That's better. That's what I want to see, Spirit Tomb. Take it, that KO. Yo, what is up, guys? Zorin here with another Pokemon Scarlet and Violet BGC video. Hope everyone's doing well. So today, I am bringing you a team by Violet down in the Pokesports Discord. I promised them I would use their team because uh, they, they gave me a hug. So that's it. I have to use it. I told them if they give me a hug. I give them spirit. I, I'll use their spirit tomb team, and I, that's what I'm going to be doing. So today we have spirit tomb here with the grassy seed because we have Rillaboom next to it, and it has a very interesting set because it has Steel Terra, but it also has Calm Mind, Star Power, and Dark Pulse. So if you don't know what Star Power does, it it increases its base power by 20 per stage boost that you have. So Calm Mind is plus. Plus one special attack, plus one special defense. It's going to give you 40 base power into store power. Grassy Seed is another plus one, so that's another base power. So about two Calm Minds, you pretty much just start nuking things with store power. So that's kind of the idea with the Spirit Tomb. Rillaboom here, obviously, to help him. To help Spirit Tomb get it off. And then we have Porygon 2 here as our Trick Room Setter. As well as Anishja. Very, very standard stuff here with Ghost Terra, Terra Blast, Ice Beam on Porygon 2 just to make sure that you can get Trick Room up in case you need to use just blow that Trick Room and people might think that Spirit Tomb is the one that puts up Trick Room but in reality it's going to be setting up you got Sinistra here as well with the Life to Trick Room Rage Fighter Macha Gacha nice little sustain Trick Room user in case you need to switch into it you also got Kong Kelder here as one of your hard carries with Guts and the Flame Orb if you don't know what Guts does basically if it's burned its attack gets boosted so that's the whole point of why Flame Orb is on Conkeldor. Just in case someone just doesn't know. And it has Facade here as well to be able to boost up that damage. Also has Fighting Terra just to make punch those Dream Punches hit really, really hard. We've got Incineroar here. You already know what Incineroar does with the safety goggles. Don't really need to talk about it. But yeah, that's the team here. We're gonna see what Spirit Tomb can do. Hopefully, we can get the Combine Star Power going. If you guys want to try out the team yourselves, the rent and the Poké will be in the description below, as always, for you guys. Uh, and make sure to like and subscribe because I'll, I really like my chicken nuggies, guys. And you guys subscribing and liking and making sure that it gets views really helps out. So really, really hope you guys enjoy the videos. Anyways, guys, let's get right into it and see what we can do with the team. All right, let's get on with it. Okay, we're still in the casual battles because Regulation H has not started, but we are getting Regulation H teams much more often. So let's see what this dude can do to us. Uh, I don't, I'm, I'm, I'm terrified. There's chlorophyll stuff, but there's also some trick room stuff on their team. Okay. All right. So we're gonna go. Ahead. Honestly, there's a. The thing is, if, if they go Obama Snow and then we go Chai T, Chai T's gonna be very sad. But it is our best chance at getting this up. Cause is this a monograph? It's the monograph team. Ah, huh. it's a monograph team. Okay. Hold on, that's actually really cool. If I lose to this, oh well. It's Evilite Diplin too. Okay. Speaking, do we bring? Do we? Do we need the Rillaboom for this? Not really. Do we have U-turn? If we have U-turn, maybe. We do not. Uh, okay. We do not have... We have Ice Beam on this dude. Uh, but we, then we can't be put to sleep on Kratos, so... Honestly, I like this better. There's other things that Kratos can hit too anyways, so... Let's bring it in the back. Alright, let's just, let's just get this going. I just want to be able to not get sent to Arceus. I don't want to get sent to Arceus, so that's why we're bringing What's-His-Face. Hoping he doesn't go into Obama Snow, but if he does, oh well. Okay, no Obama Snow, that's huge. I, I, I think that's huge anyways. Okay, my evasiveness falls. Oh. Is it the spam? Um... I wonder if it's for that. Okay. I'm gonna protect here. Because he might be trying to put me to sleep here. So let me protect. Let's just see what he does. 
Giga Drain. No sleep powder. Infestation. Oh. Okay. It's not the worst. All right, the room has been tricked. Now it thinks that we're the fastest. Well, not really, because there's a there's a Diplin. Diplin's kind of slow. So all I did is trick them into being faster. Oh man, that's fine. I'm just gonna start life doing, and I'm just gonna hit Calm Mind. They want to put me in a lock. I'm gonna let them do it. No sleep powder is interesting though. We do have safety goggles on the Incineroar as well. Oh, there it is. Oh, there it is. There's the big boy. All right. Well, we're gonna start. We're gonna start being at peace. Calming our mind, being at peace that Calyrex uh, Ice Rider did not win Masters. Yeah, you know what? Go ahead. Fine. I'm just gonna start healing. Well, I'll do this. I'll do it. You should have put me to sleep, brother. You're gonna be here for a little bit. Brother really went with the infestation plays, huh? Okay. Well, I'm going to keep doing this, and I'm just going to hit another Calm Mind. Yeah, I'm just going to, I'm just, I'm just mining my calms. Calming my mind. Minding the calm. Calming the storm. Powering up the sword. Oh. It's Dragon Breath. This man's cooking something, and I don't like it. Okay, well, I'm just gonna keep pressing this button. And just healing up. Just getting my heals. That is plus two, plus two. Pretty nice. Because right now. What are we worried about? Trick room expiring? Probably. Maybe I attack this turn then. this turn and just go for uh, the the little guy oh that did nothing like I know they're under screens but that that did absolutely nothing I don't know how I feel about that not doing anything uh why did that do okay well thanks for subscribing by the way Reese shout out to Reese but um why why did that do nothing can someone explain that to me? Huh? That did absolutely nothing. I mean, it's every light too, but even then, jeez, we did nothing. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna party shot something. Actually, I don't know what to do here. I mean, there's no real switch out, but I'm going to do this. I'm just going to start powered. Yeah, because he's going to Terra. He's going to Terra. There's a five times four weakness to fire up here. No, it's, te no, it's Terra fire. Okay. I don't like how, how little uh, Spirit Tomb did there. Because he did absolutely nothing. Oh my god, he's doing nothing. He has chilling water in this thing too. That's incredible, okay. Well, this is terrible. Um, Spiritum is actually pretty bad. Like, I get it. They're, they're under... They're under... Veil, but even... <laughs> that's really bad. Like, really bad damage. Hundred and fifteen special attack, yeah. Yikes. Yikes, yikes, yikes. And I'm kind of on the timer here with the with the infestations. I have to do that.
I have to get rid of that. Oh god, it has recover. And we don't do any damage. We do absolutely no damage too, that's the crazy part. Okay, well, this isn't going great anymore, is it? We're getting stalled by a Dippling because Spiritum does absolutely jack. <laughs> Do we just go Dark Pulse maybe? Maybe that's the plan. Hell no. I want to go in Kratos real quick. Yeah, it's just gonna spam that over and over now. The problem is, is, um, not being able to do anything to this. Well, here's another one. And yeah, now our speed's getting destroyed here. I'm gonna switch back into Incineroar here, I just want the burn. I really just want to get rid of this. So yeah, it's 20 base power, but because we did it three times. Three times is 40 times three, right? 40, 80, 120. It's 140 base power, by the way. And we're doing absolutely nothing. Aurorville's gone too. They can't even put it up either. Uh, did they forget they need the, the, the snow for that? Oh boy. This thing has no- by the way, l let me remind you, this thing has no every light right now. And there's no more screens. Oh god, this thing is so weak. <laughs> this thing is absolutely awfully weak. I'm gonna go for a dark pulse. Yeah, we're just gonna keep getting hit by that. There's not much I can do. I need to get rid of something, and this this spiritum is just not doing anything. Jesus Christ, this thing is awful. <laughs> it's a plus three special attack. Anything else would have KO'd these things already. We wasted so many resources to bring this thing up, and it's not doing anything for us. Which is really bad. Like, Incinero took like four chilling waters, and this thing hasn't KO'd anything for us. Which is really, really bad. Well, it's got a KO after about six of those stored powers. Let me remind you we have pressure, and we still couldn't. Um, we're not even PP stalling them. <laughs> Man, Spiritomb is absolutely garbage. <laughs> Holy, I didn't expect this. Oh, there's there's a poison type. Surely you can hit the poison type for good damage, right? Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna switch into Kratos now, and I'm gonna store power into you, and hope you that you can just punch like send this thing to Arceus. Because if you cannot if you cannot KO this thing at base 140 power, which turns into times 20, because it is base 140, right? 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 120, yeah, 140. So that's time times two because of, of super effective. That's 280 base power. If you cannot KO this with 200, 280 base power, I never want to see this spirit tomb in my life ever again. Like, that's a plus three calm mind. The fact that they're, they're not even worried about this thing, it's crazy. Even I'm not, I wouldn't even be worried about it. Double, double, good try. At least it's tanking those because it's it's special defense is big right now. Okay, at least it KOs that. That's good. Oh, it's a crit. Now I'm never gonna know if it, if it KOs at plus three. But a crit is a crit. I'll take it. All right, so we should just win this now, right? Even through all of that, we should just win this, right? This should just win me the game now. Well, he, he went down, but. 
I never even used Terra, by the way. <laughs> I didn't need to. I didn't actually need to, like, at all. Yeah, look at that. No setup required, just punch it in the face, it goes down. <laughs> just the way I like it. <laughs> this is not a Kong Kelder video, because uh, setting that up was was pain. Oh man, that is that is insane. Thank god they were all special attackers. Alright, let's 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 get on to the next one. <laughs> really cool though. Okay, people are cooking right now. People are indeed cooking right now, and I'm terrified. But Grimbley's definitely the one that we want to bring out, and I'm bringing Marley out. The good thing is Fairy is its only weakness, right? Because before it didn't have a weakness, now it does. I think it's always instant here. And I think we do bring Suko now. Why Suko? Because we would... Ah, Suko wouldn't be bad here. Cradles is actually really good into this too, though. Except for how... No, never mind. We all have ways to hit the ghost types, so... I think it's better to just do this. We do not have ways to hit those, those ghost types. Okay, F Fatom! Shout out to Fatom! Or Fatom! For subscribing, I appreciate it, man. These people just keep subscribing, man. You guys should you, you guys should too. If you guys aren't subscribing, you should do what they're doing. Do it. Helps me a lot. Trust me, it does. You have no idea, and we're almost, we're almost at 1500. We're almost at 1500 subs, so... Get on it, guys. It'll help out. Are we at 2,000? If I can hit 2,000 by the end of the year, I'll, I'll do a giveaway. I'll definitely be doing some sort of giveaway. Because 2,000 would be amazing before the end of the year. It would absolutely be amazing. Alright, Mr. Golden Boy. What you what you got for me? I feel like he was going for an for, for, uh, anime theme look there. If you had. Yeah. Right. I'm terrified. What, this, what, what is he doing? What is he absolutely doing with this? I am absolutely scared. But you know what? We're gonna do. We're gonna do our thing. He can do his thing. Let's just do it. Who's gonna trick room, buddy? Who is it? Are we all gonna trick room? Is the cat trick rooming? The duck trick rooming? Red tomb trick rooming? Gengar? No, Gengar doesn't trick room. Oh, he's Terra stylizing. Terra fighting? Oh man, fairy? Oh shoot! The fairy. Okay, you know what? That's fine. It's not the end of the world. Yeah, that's true. He goes for that too as well. Yeah, that, that hurt though. Well, that ain't fun. Terra Fairy is not what I was ex expecting to see today. Well, we're gonna try and do this again. Are we gonna protect? We do not have any form of healing. Is it the only issue? I don't think I, even at plus one I, I live that dazzling gleam. I actually don't think we do. Well, that was um, unfortunate. Didn't expect the Terra Gate Fairy Gengar. That's for sure. I know it, they do carry it, but I did not expect them to Terra Fairy right off the bat. I need to really boom that thing into the into the ground later. I did bring it, right? No. Oh boy. Okay. What do you have? Focus vest? That's why I wouldn't be surprised. Yeah, we're protecting here. 100%. Oh no, he's just dazzling again. Okay. That's really good damage into me, that's for sure. Oh, we got that going. I think we just uh, let Marty go. Might have to. I don't think an Ice Beam plus Star Power will KO. Because we're only at plus one, that's only 60 base power. Yeah. I'm gonna recover. I'm gonna Dark Bolt this son of a gun into the, into the ground. I hope that a plus one Dark Pulse does something. Surely it does, right? It's Meow Stick. I need to recover here, because I need to be able to heal up this damage that he just did. 
think Porygon staying alive is very, very important. Nice. Okay, Spirit Tomb. That's what I wanted to see. That's better. That's what I want to see, Spirit Tomb. Take that KO. Now you can go down. That's fine. You, you got a KO. I'll take it. Let's just heal up. Oh. Oh. I thought I was going to hit you. Yeah, that's not happening. I'm taking away your 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 meal stick privileges. That's what I was doing. Okay, another thing I could take, just take out. All right, I'm gonna switch out into Suko now. I'm actually gonna protect here, so I can actually heal. In case he also protects his uh, his Houndstone, because now Spiritum is looking pretty nice now that he Terrid. He's looking absolutely great right now. I'm gonna go ahead and switch into Rillaboom, activate the uh, the Grassy Seed, even though it's not really needed right now, but I'll take it. I'm gonna switch into Rillaboom Protect, just in case. Get Marty to do that. I'm gonna Protect. I think we're good here. We went for play rough, actually. Not what I expected. Now go ahead. You can dazzling gleam all you want right now, buddy. Oh, damn! That did a lot. All right, we're not assault vest. I completely forgot about that. <laughs> okay, we're gonna go ahead and fake out the ugly, the ugly dude. We're gonna dark pulse. Is it do we? Maybe we could just wood hammer this thing into the ground. Nah, I think it's more safer. Wait, let me, let me see. How many turns do we have actually? Turns. I'll go for the fake out just in case it has sash and go for the uh, dark pulse. I feel like this thing has the sash. Yeah. Holy! That's fine. <laughs> I only needed one turn. I have to switch out to, to activate it anyways. Okay, that did not KO, sadly. Sadly, that was not a KO. That is not what I want to see, Spirit 2. Oh well, it can KO me, I'll take at least. I guess that's a good thing. Alright, let's go back into Dwayne the Rock Johnson Kitty Cat. Real quick. We never went, we never went into it in the first place, but... At least Red Tomb did some softening up, you know? Well, we'll take that. I just realized how small this Rillaboom is. This Rillaboom is tiny. Little guy. Nope, that's not what I wanted to do. I wanted to Woodhammer the, the ugly ghost thing. And I wanna knock off. We don't need to go for a fake out here. We absolutely don't wanna go for a fake out here. We just wanna hit them both. As hard as possible. This man that has no pro this man forgot what protects are. That's what I'm understanding right now. If if, if that fake out did as much as it did, then this is about to just destroy him. Assault vest. Okay. You know what, Spirit Tomb? I don't feel. Uh, I'm sorry. I apologize. That that assault vest was why it survived. You're you're fine. You did you did good damage. You, could, you did good damage. I wouldn't have known. I wouldn't have known it was assault vest until I knocked it off. Those things don't usually run assault vest. You usually want you know will o wisp on it. So. Kind of insane to see. So you know what, Spirit Tomb, you did it. We'll give it to you. Okay, so we're just gonna... I mean, we can't lose, right? There's no way we lose now. I'm just gonna go for the Grassy Glide. I'm just gonna party shot out. Yeah, there's the rock side. That's kind of what I wanted to switch out, but... I decided to go for the party shot instead. I think that was actually the better play. As long as I don't flinch. If I flinched, <laughs> that was a terrible play, and I could actually... I could have lost because of that. Maybe. It's a big maybe. I was expecting the rock side because of Rocky Payload. Paylo Rocky Payload, I think, it's his ability, where it makes rock moves hit harder. I wouldn't even be surprised if this thing is grass, uh, Rock Terra to go with it. 
So I'm going to go for another Grassy Glide. I'm just going to go for a... Honestly, a Terra Blast is fine in this situation. And we do have a Fake Out turn now with Incineroar. And it's at minus one. It'll be a minus two once it comes back. So there's no way he can win anymore. He's going for dual wing beak. Okay, cool. Thank you. And let's heal up the game. All right, Spirit Tomb did good. Spirit Tomb did did really good into this. Did really really good. Even at, at plus one, I gave it too much beef last time, but it was it, it was it was a super salty man. I wasn't sure on the damage, but Spirit Tomb definitely showed me the error of my ways. So my bad, Spirit Tomb. You did good. You did good. Let's just let's hope that it can do good in the last last battle. All right, let, let's go straight into it. Okay, well this is a scary team, for sure. This is a scary team, and there's the one thing I did not want to deal with. Oh boy. Okay. Our Chaladon. This team has no way to actually fight our Chaladon too. That is going to be very very rough. We're gonna need this, and we're gonna need this. Yeah, this is gonna be a rough one. Duko's definitely coming out. I think it's just Kratos. I need to set up Marley as fast as possible. That's my plan here. If we're going with this. Because uh, we don't have any reliable ways to deal with this so if we lose i'm expecting to lose because this team does not look like it can handle our chaladon not our chaladon pelipper because pelipper for some reason covers our chaladon so well okay well let's see what happens all right well we're just gonna trick room trick room on mind, I guess, or protect. You might just double in to it. I'm gonna I'm protect just in case. I'm really hoping they go into the spirit tomb slot because otherwise, I should have just calm minded. And then we're just gonna ignore a Chaladon until the end. That is my plan. Very, very shaky plan, but it's it's my only plan because if I hit it, then my dude is not gonna do much. My, my uh, Kratos is not going to do much. Yeah, okay, good. Perfect. Did he go for Electro Shot? That would be hilarious. <laughs> he did. Ah, uh, that's funny. He thought I was going to let him flip turn on me. Oh, uh, that's, what, that's what I was hoping for, that he was going for a flip turn. Okay, well, if that's the case, we're just gonna go ahead and Terra Blast and we're just gonna go for a Combine. Yeah, he hard swaps now. He got a little greedy there. Now, Predator has to take a nice slap in the face for that. Alright, plus one. So he, So is he, though. Nice damage. Okay, cool. Yeah, he did double in on it too. Jeesh. Okay. Let's just Terra Blast into this again and go for another Combine, I guess. It's a little bit rough, but I think it's fine. He did protect. Okay. I wasn't sure if he was going to protect or what, but kind of had. I need to get rid of this slot. There's another electro shock because this thing is such a balanced mon, perfect mon, very balanced. Did he just shoot the other guy? Oh, perfect. Cool. I'll take it. I'm gonna go into my dude now. 
Actually, what's stopping me from just calm minding one more time? Him attacking me, I guess, would be kind of bad. I'll switch out and I'll go for a Dark Pulse. I'm not even going to go for store power here. Store power isn't needed. We'll switch out into uh, Suko here. It is a plus two though. That's the only scary part. The Grassy Seed doesn't really help though because they're all special attackers. But it is what it is. Incineroar. Okay, yeah, that's gonna... That'll do it. That'll do it. For sure. I actually went into, uh, what's-its-face instead. A Draco. And it's enough to KO. Damn. Yikes. Big yikes, okay. That's a real big yikes. Okay, I'm gonna have to um, switch out into... I mean, I expected this, to, to be honest. <laughs> I expected this, to be honest. All right, get, give me this again. I'm protect. Gotta get my guts boost. There's the fake out. Oh boy, here comes Electro Shot again. What a balance! What a balanced Pokemon game, freak. Thank you for making this. Cause Duraludon totally needed an evolution. I did not need an evolution. He hasn't Terrod, right? No, he has not. Oh, but we lost our... Uh... We lost our thing, though. Kind of bad. Alright, we're going to have to do this. Do we just send it? And pray? Heck it, let's do it. Probably Terra's here. Palafin came out. Okay. He's gonna Terra, yeah. There's the Fairy Terra, yeah. I should've went for Facade, but I wasn't sure. There's some people in Casual that are just crazy. Wait, this is this is Grass, okay. I was like, oh, Fairy. No, but this, at least I'm still doing neutral damage, so it's fine. What's not fine is how broken our Chalodon is and unhealthy for this meta. They should have banded while they were, while they were added next to because it's it's practically restricted in a in a low power power level format. Like look look how ba look how unbalanced that is. That's so unbalanced. That's just not balanced. We got one shotted just like that. Just like that, we got one shotted again. Like, that is not balanced. I don't know who at Game Freak thought that making a second evolution for Duraludon when it was already really high on, on base stats, and then giving it an Electro Shot boost where his best teammate that gives him rain is also able to cover his weaknesses really well. I don't, I, I really want to know who at Game Freak thought that was, that was like a... Uh, like like uh, an incredible idea. Like I need to know who bans that mon. I just want to talk, you know. I, I just want to talk. Jesus Christ, man. Oh, there's a switch out into Incineroar. Into the other thing that's not very balanced and got buffed for some reason. Even though everybody everybody and their mothers said Incineroar is like the most broken thing in the game and they just decided to make it. 
they just decided to make it uh, even stronger this gen by giving it more utility. But yeah, this is pretty much over. I couldn't. I was never gonna beat this team. Not with not with Spirit Tomb. Not with Spirit Tomb, because I can't even risk punch. Because that's the problem with our Chalodon. You can't even risk hitting it. And then when I thought I was fine, uh, what's his face got one shot it anyways. That plus one, it can't handle it. That's that's how you know it's power creep because it can't even handle the, the Draco Meteor at full health. I was really really banking on him being able to at least take one hit. Since he can't, uh, yeah, pretty much over. It's pretty much over. Yeah, let's just let's just get out of here because this is not this is not fun anymore. This is definitely not fun. If you don't have an answer to our Chaladon, it's just over. With ter Terrastalize, if there's no way to force the other things to Terrastalize, then it's pretty much over. Because quote unquote, our Conkledor is our counter, but he he just tears out of his weakness. All right, let's get out of here. Okay, well, unfortunately, we ended up fighting our Chaladon, but it is what it is. People are going to abuse that Mon like crazy in this regulation. So, not much you can do. You really need to have multiple answers to our Chaladon. You can't have just one. You need multiple answers. And Kalkothor just can't do it either anyways, because it can't even take a Draco Meter at plus one. Because that thing was a plus one. That was only plus one. And it <laughs> Draco Meter was more than enough to take it out. So, yeah, Kalkothor. Powercraft. It was. It's a super strong mon, but it got powercraft by a mon that didn't need an evolution. So Game Freak, I know you. Li you hear like I know you like pay attention to tournaments and stuff. For the love of God, I need to know who thought Incineroar needed more utility when everybody and their mother says that Incineroar is the king of the BGC, and we know how powerful Incineroar is. Then thought, ah, yeah, Duraludon needs an evolution. Let's make Duraludon an evolution, like. No, guys. No, I know you guys think about your competitive scene. That that's why you ba do balance changes. So it can't be like, oh, we just cater to the casual. No, you definitely make you, you, you make balance changes. So there's no way you're not paying attention. But anyways, guys, hope we, hopefully you guys enjoyed. Rhythm did fine in the in two in the battles that doesn't have our Chaladon. But if you're gonna be running into our Chaladon, this team is probably not gonna be able to do much against it. But anyways, guys, hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.